Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you how to screen record on any Samsung Galaxy Note 20, whether it's the Note 20 or Note 20 Ultra. It's the same exact process. And like I said before, I think this works on pretty much any other Android device running Android 10 or newer. So that's really, really awesome. So the process is pretty much this. You want to be on your home screen of your Samsung Galaxy Note 20 or the 20 Ultra. You don't need to download apps or anything. And all you want to do is swipe down, basically get into the status bar right here. And you want to swipe down once more and you want to basically get into this panel which is the control center there's a ton of different toggles and everything but the one you want to specifically search out for is the toggle called screen recorder so you can go ahead and kind of swipe through as you can see my screen recorder icon is right here however if you swipe through and you're still not able to find any of the screen toggle screen recorder toggles all you basically have to do at that point is to go ahead and hit these little three dots right here you want to go click on button order and you will be able to see all the other buttons that you have. You can go and change them out and the buttons that you have not used yet, you can go and drag them down here. So if the screen recorder one is here, you just want to drag it down there. Now, once you have that out of the way, once you locate the screen recorder toggle, all you want to do is tap on it. You'll get this little dialog. You want to go ahead and click allow. You'll see this little thing. Now, if you want to allow your audio to be recorded at the same time, you want to go and click allow. If you don't want it, go and click deny. In this case, we're going to go click allow. And you're going to want to read this screen recorder will have access to yada 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 so now basically you want to see you know whether you want to have access to either the sounds from your phone so if you want to record like if you're recording a video or a TikTok or whatever you want this but if you don't want sound then you want to click no sound but if you want the sound being recorded as well as what you're talking and what you're saying so let's say the TikTok audio and my reaction to it or whatever then you would want this so in this case we're just going to go and click this we can go and click start recording and it'll go and count down from three so i can get ready and as you can see it's starting to record as soon as that little thing up there dims down then it usually means it's done you know you're ready to record and it's recording right now so i can go and do whatever i want to yada 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 and whenever you're done all you have to do is go and click this stop button up here but what's really cool they also allow you to have that pause button there too which is really cool so once it's done all you have to do is basically make your way over to your gallery app which is right here and as you can see i have the video right here so it's recorded. I mean, I can do whatever I want to at this point with it and it should play the video. As you can see, it's playing right now. It didn't look like it was playing, but that's really pretty much it. You don't have to download apps or anything like that, which is really cool. So if you guys have any questions or into any other problems, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys could hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my main channel. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Tolman.